Shares of Tesla are down, but off the lows of the session. Phil LeBeau is back in Chicago, has been watching the quarter since last night. Phil? And Carl, one reason the stock is a little bit under pressure is because of questions surrounding what's going to happen with the CFO position at the company. At the end of the earnings call last night, Tesla announced that CFO Deepak Ahuja, who's been with the company a number of years, will be retiring in a couple of months. And the new VP, uh, the new CFO will be the VP of Finance. He's being promoted. Wall Street doesn't really know him very well, so there's some questions there. That's one reason for the pressure. The other question that came out of this conference call is just how much Tesla is relying on its upcoming plant, the plant they're building in Shanghai, to provide Model 3s, specifically by the end of this year. In fact, Elon Musk says the goal is to build 3,000 Model 3s per week at that Shanghai plant by the end of this year, in part because they need to bring down the price of the Model 3. The demand for Model 3 is insanely high. The inhibitor is, not, is, is affordability. It's just like people literally don't have the money to buy the car. It's got nothing to do with desire. They just don't have enough money in the bank account. <laughs> if, if the car can be, if be made more affordable, they will, the, the, the demand is extraordinary. All of this raises questions about Tesla's ability to hit its target for delivering between 360 and 400,000 vehicles this year. For a point of reference, guys, on the far right, you see that the company delivered 245,000 vehicles last year. I should point out, Carl, that 360 to 400K, that's a little below what many on Wall Street were expecting. So that's another reason why there's a bit of pressure on Tesla shares today.